I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome to a game called The Wolf Among Us. Now this is yet another Telltale game. I'm on Telltale's balls right now. I'm hanging off because I'm having such a good time. I'm a fan of them, okay? And this is another one of their hits that they put out. Overwhelmingly positive reviews on Steam. So you know your boy gotta play it. So if you're down to come along on this journey with me, everybody sit back, relax, and most importantly, have a good time because I know I'm about to have a good time and I'll try my best to do this game justice. This is the wolf among us. Everybody sit back, relax, and enjoy. But yeah, I read the synopsis. Fairy tale creatures all over the place. So you might see some names that you're familiar with if you keep up with fairy tales. And I kinda do. I'm not gonna front like I know all the fairy tale characters, but I know a few. And I know that Big B Wolf is the big bad wolf. So that's a start. I know who that is. He's big and bad, and he's a wolf. <laughs> and he kind of looks like Hugh Jackman, low key. Tenement building, South Bronx, sometime after midnight. Toads254, okay. Mr. Toad? Oh, shit. Big B! Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I'll get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. I'm looking at a three-foot toad. Enough excuses, no to toad. No harm done. We'll be a nice guy. Look, no harm done. I'll give you a pass, but listen. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. Oh yeah, test me. Test me, boy. I will. I'll send you, you know up there. what I mean? Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I don't make the rules. Get it fixed. Not my problem. Dot, dot, dot. Get it fixed, Toad. Get it fixed. It's not complicated, Toad. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fuck you now. See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B. Before so what have I walked into? What do you want me to do? Head upstairs. Don't even say anything. Oh, thanks for that, Big B. You're a real gentleman. Come on, dog. Don't give me that. This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. Do it yourself. Why is he so pissed? I'm heading up. Fine. I'm heading up. Get your glamour. Furry prick dog shite. Tell me how to spend my money. I heard Dad, that. The lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get the fuck back inside. You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey, look at me. Just stop, okay? You're drunk. Let go. Jackpot. Let's hang up that phone right here. Because we don't want to be hearing that. Dink, 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 And plus, it's just polite to hang up a phone. Know who I am now? Hey, look at me! Knock on the door, or kick the door. Man, we're the big bad wolf, baby! Let's kick that shit open! Surprise, motherfucker! No shit, Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You've got something on your face. What the fuck are you talking about, you stupid Ooh. That's uncalled for. What's going on here? Why'd you hit her? Everyone, calm down. All right, everyone. Oh, okay, you don't want to calm down? I'll calm you down, you big bald fuck. What are you going to fucking do, huh? What am I going to fucking do? Get the fuck out of the way. This is your last you warning. Again. Woody, this is your last warning. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Ooh, that's what I would have said. Oh, hell no. Let's go, boy. Okay, now you're going to get it, bitch. You like that? Okay, uh, the faucet. 
Oh, you think that scares me? Nope. Juke them. Psych. Let's go. Come on, weak ass pussy boy. Ah. Hell. This is savage. Savagery. All right, throw you into the bed frame, bitch. Now I'm gonna fuck you, and not in the good way, bitch. Ah. Yeah. Come on, bitch. Ah. Okay, now let's throw you onto the sofa. Had enough? Oh fuck. Come get some. It's a fucking challenge. Come get some. Oh fuck. Okay, here you go. Oh damn that throat punch. Yes, get a hoit. Back off, asshole. Oh, you think I'm scared? Come on, bro. Kneecap! <laughs> and the ear! Okay, the head. This is intense already. Hasn't even been five minutes. Oh, fuck me. Oh, fuck me! Give me that fucking axe! Give me that shit! Oh, crap. Okay. Ooh! <laughs> Hell yeah! You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. <laughs> oh, fuck. Say that word again. Fuck Shut up. Be nice or I'll make you wait outside. You hear me? Say it again. Say that word one more time. What? Bitch? Ooh, what did I say? Mm. When you say oh, bitch, you get the boot. Shit. You broke my jaw, you bastard. Those and subtitles, though. Talk. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> what shit. happened? What are you doing here? You need to leave. What happened, senorita? What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry. You saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off. What are you doing here? Look, this is you just need the to leave. Start of a are you all right? For me. I just you all right? The money he she got a little black eye. Go. Are you all right? I'm hunky dory. Thanks for asking. Hunky dory? What in the shit? What's your name? What's your name? Whatever you'd like it to be, handsome. Okay. Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. Sorry, sheriff. Wouldn't want to add any difficulty to your night. Why was he hitting you? First he was hitting on me. He asked me. Then he pimp slapped me. Him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hun? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of <laughs> stones. And threw him in the fucking hey, river. That's who the out. fuck I am. Will you, you excuse me a moment? Bitch. Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? By all means. Come on. Oh shit! <laughs> That's one way to leave the scene. That would have killed people in real life. Hey, Toad. My car. Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. Oh, no, by all means. Sorry about the car. Time. Get off Make the street. How's your insurance? Hopefully he's with Geico. Anything? Sorry no about the car. Uh, sorry about the car. We ended up going out the window. Couldn't be avoided. I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. Even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Oh boy. Here we go. Get your kind pickin' hands off me. Alright, let's see who can choke each other out the longest. Yeah, gouge the eyes out. Gouge those. Oh, fuck. Come on, man. In there. Come on out, you Want you? Oh, mm. you out of your Stop 
choking me, you slut! Ah! Yeah! Holy fuck! Jesus! Was that really necessary? An axe to the back of the skull? Good lord. That was hot, though. That was hot. <laughs> and he's still alive. Can these people not die or something? What are you doing? Leave him alone. Thanks. 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 Don't mention it. Damn, I feel bad for her. She has I'm all these bruises. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. Oh, broke ass. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more for me. He'll be fine. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. <laughs> These <Let> subtitles. <laughs> let her? Stop her. I'll let her. She has all these day. bruises on her I'm arms and her us. face. I guess it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. I suppose it is. Okay, that makes sense. Because I was like, if this guy has an axe in the back of his head, he should be dead, but I forgot. They're fairy tale creatures. <laughs> that made me cringe. Lighter cigarette? Oh yeah, come on, be a pimp. I got you, girl. Thanks. No problemo. Who do you work for, really? These lips are sealed. Sorry. Come on. Hey, you like my ribbon? Sure. Beautiful. Stop changing the subject. I'm trying to help you. Be a beautiful. Beautiful. Thank you. I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. And he's gone. Shit. Really? Totally license plate? That's totally awesome, bro. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. This is about Fable Town. He hit you, are you sure? Yeah, you never hit a woman no matter what. He hit you. He needs to pay for that. He's got nothing to give, Sheriff. I checked. Besides, I just swung an axe into the guy's head. I'd say we're even. Maybe I should be arresting you. I'm not going to be doing this for much longer. So, now's your chance. Awkward. How much was the owed you? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. Give her some money? Wish I could help. Let's be generous. Let's see, I've got, uh... It's 20. That would suck if he didn't even have 100. He's trying to give her money. 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? He doesn't have Dick. enough. 58 okay. bucks. I'll I'll see fine. you. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I am? You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Well, yeah, but I'm moving to a bigger Good place soon, so... You should get clean. Don't worry. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. 
That's harsh. Some of these look pretty I clean up okay. Tell me what you really think. I didn't That's have time. Mark. <laughs> didn't have time to pick or that answer. Maybe not. Hey. Yeah? I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. I'll see you around, Wolf. Later. Bigby is a pimp! That's what I'm talking about. I like this so far. Reminds me of... What does it remind me of? I don't know what it reminds me of, but... The, the graphics kind of reminds me of like the old school Ninja Turtles games. And I was a big fan of those. Like the ones that you could play with your other friends. The Woodland Luxury Apartments. Late. Yeah, it doesn't even give you a time. It's just like, oh, it's late as fuck. That's all you need to know. Let's check this plaque. Luxury Apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. Who there? I see you. Don't make me come over there. Come on out. Come on out. All right. All right. Beauty. Hello, Big B. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know. Where are you going? Why did you hide? Odd. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. Well, it makes no. you more suspicious when you're hiding behind a tree, you know that? Damn it. I'm late. Wait, she was late, but she was hiding behind a tree? What? Story doesn't add up, girl. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much I promise. as it is, and I promise, it would girl. just make my life a lot easier. Sure. No, I promise, for real. Promise? I promise. I promise. Thank you, Bigby. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I, I appreciate it, Bigby. It's not that I trust you, I just don't want to deal with your shit. Like, you said you needed to go somewhere, but then you were hiding behind a tree. I mean, I'm not good at math, but something's not adding up here, girl. If you need to go somewhere, why would you hide behind a tree? I'm just saying, okay? I'm no detective. But when I need to go somewhere, I don't hide behind trees first. I know she was trying to avoid him, I get that. But if you're trying to go somewhere, then just leave. Don't be around that area, just go so he won't even see you in the first place. You guys know what I mean? You guys get what your old pal Jay's saying? Let's talk to the desk. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, there's a guy. Hey, <laughs> you wink? I don't think so, buddy. Probably for the best. Touch the suit of armor? Oh, grow up. Be mature, Big B. Let's open the mailbox. Been a while since I got any mail. Is it because nobody likes you? Seventh day in a row. Not even junk mail? Wait, where do I live? <laughs> I don't want to make a mistake. Uh, where do I live? Where do I live? Where do I live? Wait, she does live here, right? Because it says Beast at the top, Mr. and Mrs. So why did she need to hide? Hmm. That's weird. Because I know that they're from Beauty and the Beast, obviously, because their name's Beauty. But, uh, okay. I see. 
This game. Wait, 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 wait. What is that? Big B's name tag. Damn thing fell off again. Ah. Cool. How much longer is this gonna go on? So this dude gets no respect. Doesn't even get a, like a cool nameplate. Sorry about that, bud. Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Oh shit. Um, haven't seen her, bud. Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. All right, so I'm going to conclude this first episode here. We are playing as the Detective Big Bad Wolf. If you guys want this to become a series, make sure you give this video one big fat like and tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is dead too! <laughs>